Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac. Another day, another run. Will it be the final one? Who knows? So let's see what we're jumping into here. So we've got Mr. Squeezy to start off with, as well as Isaac's tears. We've got really good tier rate, not so good of damage, and really good shot speed. Well, let's just go ahead and start off by jumping into a curse room, I guess. We're really not going to be gaining anything from that. All right. You know what? I'm okay with that. And the code, for those who want to play along, 62XWC482. Well, let's go ahead and get into today's run. I'm really curious what exactly is going to be going on with this one. Now, Isaac's tier, not the greatest. It's a really terrible version of Tammy's head. That's pretty much all there is to it. Oh, that little fly hit me. Oh. Well, at least that doesn't actually uh, take away some... That doesn't actually take away any real health here. Uh, okay, a little bit of an interesting room. But yeah, it, it... Tammy's head adds 25 damage to the tears that go in all directions. Isaac's tears, they just kind of... They're just kind of there. They just kind of go. That's really all there is to it. So they're basically the worst space bar item ever. Actually, no, there's worse out there. There's worse for space bar items, but it's not that great. And infinite keys for this floor. All right. Well, I'll definitely take that. That could definitely be interesting. I'm going to want to find this item room quickly because uh, I have a feeling the start for today's... Oh, wow. Taking damage there. The start for today's run is not the greatest, so... Oh, I just realized our shot speed is amazing because of the whip worm. Right. That's why we have such amazing shot speed right now. So without that, we would not be having... How much do we have without it? Oh, about average, I would say. Okay, well, it's a free shop, so I might as well check it. Uh, I would like the jar of flies. If I can end up affording that, Jar of Lies would be really nice, considering that our current spacebar item is crap. So, uh, I guess we'll just find our item room here, and maybe we'll find some bombs as well. Right, that's the way we came. So, it's got to be to the right. Okay. Oh, boy. Oh, God. <laughs> ah! Okay, that wasn't fun. That wasn't fun at all. Well, at least we got a bomb. That'll help us afford the, uh... That'll hopefully help us afford the jar of flies. All right, item room. I'm gonna need you to pay out, because I've managed to lose three hearts on the first floor. This isn't very good. Usually when I end up having that, I, I go on full tilt here. All right, bomby bomb. That's not the worst. We'll put a bomb here so I can reach this golden chest. And, uh, yeah, that's this is our build. That's that's everything, folks. That is uh, all she wrote on this one. Ha. Ho. He. Her. Uh. Please. Stop. Please. Okay. All right. Don't like this one bit. Please stop. Please? Okay. All right. Let's go fight our boss. Let's go pick up this half a heart that we, uh, that we got from that good old golden chest that we spent a bomb on. I guess we'll go buy the jar of flies right now. Ugh. I don't like... I don't like where this is going so far. That's fine, though. I can work with it. I've had worse starting builds. I've definitely had worse. So let's go ahead, place a bomb here, bomb both of those. And we need 15 cents. Probably two more. Yep. Gonna have to use all the bombs on this one in order to get that. Take the jar of flies. 
hell? Let's see what we got here. Ooh, Larry. All right, not a bad first boss. Do the segments that I end up knocking off... Yeah, they do actually count. Nice. Cool. I was wondering if those actually counted for uh, my good old jar of flies here. Here. Go get them. Go get them, buddy. Two more flies. Alright, stem cells, a little bit of extra health, a little more shot speed. Hell yeah, dude. This is uh this is a build. This is something that I Oof. Oh boy. Alright. This is something else. And I can't take any damage. I need to focus on not getting hit at all because I want to make sure that we get our first devil deal. So, need to find a soul heart of some kind. That would be really nice, so that way I don't lose my devil deal. Uh... No, you little sh... I forgot I had homing bombs, right. Right, I have homing bombs. I forgot. Okay, then. Okay, then. Need to wait on that. Virgo? Yay! I think. Well, Virgo's nice because it makes it so all the pills are always good. Yeah. Yeah, uh-huh. That's, that's, that's where that's going. We're gonna need a bomb. Oh, you. Mm. We need multiple bombs. We need multiple bombs right now. All right, we're going to save up our flies here. We're going to save up our flies for a rather deadly room, or I guess we could jump into our boss right now. There's no reason. Oh, geez. Not this version. Not this version of Dingle. Please. It spawns spiders. I guess that's not that bad, right? Yeah. He's not moving. So that's the plus. Yeah, he's, he's, just, he's just whistling. Yeah, all right, cool. We can work with this. As long as you don't ever slide. Do you actually slide? Does this version of Dingle actually slide? Also, why are there spiders? Oh God, it does. And it goes really fast too. Okay. Well. Thankfully, the spiders allowed us to actually kill the boss. All right. Well, we managed to get our devil deal. Hopefully, it's good. The belt. Okay. Oh, boy. All righty, then. This is going to be an interesting deal here. I want Incubus. Because it's the only form of damage that I'm going to ever see. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. All right. So Incubus, it's a little bit of a risky deal, especially after that. Especially if we're gonna get a champion that chases us down. We only have one heart right now, but it's a good one heart. It's a, it's a good one heart that we have. I just need to find one bomb and have that one bomb give me a soul heart. And then we're good get any kind of heart container just something anything i could go into the boss challenge room that's really tempting at the same time not i need money so that i can buy a bomb i don't know how to feel about this 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 whole build this is not going in the direction that i want Oh, uh, we're gonna check the sh There's a soul heart for five cents. If I could get five cents. I'm gonna, gonna destroy these fires. I need five cents. There's nothing there. 
If I had just not fucked up that one bomb, that one bomb placement is gonna come back to haunt me. Okay, this guy gives a soul heart. This guy gives a soul heart if we can kill him. So that'll make me feel just a little bit better. Oh, okay, good. I don't want to touch the red chest right now because if they have a troll bomb in them, I probably would have died. So I'm trying to play this smart here. We have two bombs, so we can actually go and use those to get more chests, or not more chests, uh, more tinted rocks. I'll be able to get a little bit of money out of it, actually. So I'll be able to get my health back here. It's going to be a bit of a longer run, I can already tell. But we're going to have to play this floor out to the best of our ability here. Alright, do we get anything extra? We got an extra soul heart. Uh, we've got a strength card. Curse of the Tower and a troll bomb, which is why I'm glad I didn't pick that up. We are not going to be taking Curse of the Tower because it's not a very good item. We can use our bombs here. We're going to use one on this tinted rock. Grab ourselves a soul heart and a key. Use one on this tinted rock here. Grab ourselves another soul heart. A lot of money. Uh, could actually use that money to buy a bomb, which will get me another uh, golden chest opportunity. We're going to jump right into this. And these pills are always going to be good. Guppy's tail. Hmm. So we've got a piece of the kitty cat. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. You know what? I'm actually not going to buy the extra bomb there. I'm going to save my money for the next floor. Because of Guppy's tail, I want to keep my keys. Because I'm going to be getting a whole bunch of golden chests. And that's what happens every time you get Guppy's tail. It increases your chance to find all the chests. And we will wait on that cursed room until we can see whether or not we will be getting another bomb because I don't want to waste, you know, the potential there for another stone chest that I can't open. I think we played out that floor pretty well. I definitely do think that was the, the, the good plays there on that room to go from something that is just absolutely awful to something a little bit better. All right, so we'll just use our jar of flies real quick here. And I like this Incubus, especially now that we have it in the correct spot. Rune bag. I'll take it. Maybe we can get start getting some Jeros, some Perthros, and yes. Second piece of Guppy. We are now one away from being Kitty Cat. Had I taken Guppy's head in that double deal, I actually would have Guppy right now. Anyway. Anyway, um, <laughs> oh, I'm an asshole. I love it. Oh, so now we're guppy, and uh, our run got significantly easier. We went from a run that may not make it to a run that is basically guaranteed a victory. Welcome to my streets, everybody. They are beautiful. Uh, Ansa's room. We'll use that on the next floor. We'll use that one on the next floor here. We don't really have much in the way of keys right now, so I think we're just going to go ahead and go fight our boss here. So now the jar of flies really isn't... Oh, wow. This is a interesting room to fight you in. Okay, that was a little different. Uh, we don't really have any key. We only have one now. Uh, Empress. I don't know what you do, but you will be positive. I didn't say it would be good. I just said it would be positive. Or, you know, it's, just, it's not going to be negative. That's all we need to know. Hey, guys. 
go ahead and hit that. We have some bombs, so we'll go jump into that curse room real quick, especially since now um, I actually don't take half a heart of damage going in. I only take half a heart of damage going out of it, so let's go check out what's in here. We get a little dark heart, so we got half a heart back from that room. Not too bad. I still want to find my... I still... Ooh, curved horn. Nice. I still want to find my shop. I don't have any keys now, but at the same time, I think we might be able to get one drop, maybe? Huh? There we go. There's our key. What do we got in here? The battery. That could be really sexy. So we're going to go ahead and grab that. I'm actually kind of curious if that's going to drop... Um, you know, double up the double up on the flies. So if I use that, it'll spawn two flies for the one, etc., etc. Oh, there's a key right here. Well, we might as well full clear at this point. I mean, we've already cleared basically everything else, and we do have a tears up pill in our in our pool here. I believe this might have been the tears up. It is nice. So we just need one more to hit the cap there, and we're gonna keep the Ansa's room. I don't really need the strength card. All right, well, let's uh, let's move on, shall we? Let us move on to the next room. So we've got a double key room. We've got a mini boss. We'll go ahead and take that on real quick. Good old gluttony. And we're gonna say no to the chests right now. Almost want a full clear just to see if we don't get a uh, golden chest first. And we got a little bit of luck up, which, hey, it's not that bad. Hmm. Ow. Yeah, I do kind of want to, like, with, with how scarce keys are right now, I almost want a full clear, see if we don't get a golden chest or golden key first. Nah, I'm just lying. We're just gonna jump right in there. Scatter bombs. Hmm. Now that could be really interesting. It's not really that good, but eh, if I need to bomb my shop. Well, I already have all the pieces of Guppy, but I mean, if we want to make Super Guppy, that's perfectly fine by me. Oh, hey, look at that. Uh, sure, we'll take multi-dimensional baby and we'll take missing page two. Just so that way, I am not on my... Ooh, hello. Uh, I was going to say, just so I'm not on my Polaroid anymore. And we're going to keep Guppy's paw so that I can actually stay on my Polaroid. Yeah. We're just going to keep that. And we took the multidimensional baby because... Okay. You know, it's not, it's not the worst thing in the world. It'll allow us to do a little bit of extra damage. And there was a key over here as well as a Jera rune. Very nice. We will check that out. We could save the Jera rune for the chest and double up on the items in there. <laughs> Wouldn't be a bad idea. Speaking of doubling up. Speaking of doubling up. Hmm. You know what? Sure. We're going to get rid of the paw. That was a long time with that paw, but we're going to go ahead and take that. Uh, no, I don't want the Eternal Heart. And we are going to save that all the way to the chest. I guess I should open these up? Yeah. I guess I should open those up. But I, no, I need to save the keys. Oh, good. Now contract from below. Agalos. I guess I don't really need anything. Yeah, we can just kind of, we can just kind of go. And I kind of want to like ask this to the, to the people watching. When we get a run like this, where, you know, we start off, it's not so good, but then we end up getting like a ridiculous build in a couple of floors. Should we go fast? Should we go quick through our floors? And now we've hit the speed cap, so now we uh, move as fast as possible. We just need a little bit of tier rate reduction, as well as some tier rate delay. But would you rather see me kind of clear through the game as quickly as possible? You know, obviously going for the breaks wherever they are viable at. You know, if I can, if I can find something cool, then I'll definitely 
use it, but I don't see a reason to make sure that I full clear every floor, including the womb, unless I'm going specifically for a break or something like that. So that's why I end up asking. I'm curious. Y'all are the one watching. I mean, I know this streak is... Knock on wood, I know this run is going to be a victory regardless of what I do at this point. Assuming I just do a ridiculous throw. Which has happened. I won't lie, I've been terrible before. Perks. Um, perks, okay. I do want to at least make sure I always go to my uh, item room at the very least, as well as my shop. What do we get in here? Stopwatch. No. We'll buy the key, because we're going to need eight keys. Don't need to do that. And uh, we're going to move on. Because I might be able to make it to my boss rush. Maybe. Maybe. Probably not. I'd have to clear the next floor in a minute to make it to the boss rush. I don't feel like that's going to happen. Yeah, no. Maybe if we had gone a little bit faster. Eh. Oh, well. I just realized I have car battery. <laughs> I just realized I had car battery, which means this double item is going to double everything twice. Oh, boy. <laughs> uh, that'll give me maximum tier rate. I guess I'll take it. I didn't want it because it would ruin my Polaroid, but eh, I guess it doesn't really matter. Because thankfully, I've got an arcade. Uh, we don't need those. Ah, now for my favorite room. Always, always a favorite. Always a favorite here. Uh, demon baby, I'm sorry, but I don't want you. We could use a little bit more health here. That would be kind of nice to have. Yeah, I probably should stop tanking all of the damage. Control bombs. A couple of extra keys. We need, like I said, we need at least eight. But we might need more. A little brimstone. Sure, you can come along with us. And greed. Oh, what do we have here? Jera. We keep getting Jera runes with Jera runes. Now, the question is, would it be better to Jera hit the eight chests and then double everything? I guess. Because I don't have that many keys. I guess it's going to depend on how many keys I end up getting on which is the best way to play out our chest here, but we're going to get a lot of items. We are going to get a lot of items from our chest. This is, no, this is Necro 2. Okay. Telepills. We don't need that. Hagalaz. We don't need that. I would... Actually, hold on. We're going to use that Hagalaz real quick. I do want to try and get some health to kind of secure our victory here. I feel like if I can, I should. So let's use our Hagalaz. Let's jump in here. Jump out so I don't have to fight anything. And let's grab all these extra hearts that it may or may not have spawned. And hello, ghost baby. Go ahead and come along with us. Okay. Hello, Mama. Bye, Mama. Uh, we're going to go up because we're going to try and go for a super item run. There's nothing else in this room. Moving on. Yeah. And we're guaranteed a double deal on the next floor. I was kind of hoping that we were going to get one this time, but eh, it's whatever. Oh, poor Chub, man. Poor Chub. Got a whole bunch of extra bombs here. I don't want those. Ansa's rune, I do want that. I gotta save my keys. 
I have to save my keys. It could, if it, it could possibly pay out, but I want to save them. Uh, we don't need money. We'll go ahead and go into our secret room, however. I don't need money. Stop giving me this cash. All right. Ow! Challenge room? Nope. Oh, I'm not liking this health that we're, that we're tanking away here. Blank rune. I was really hoping that the random rune was going to give us something nice. Do I go into my cursed room? It feels like incredibly unnecessarily risky. I don't think going in there would be a good idea right now. Nah. I don't think going in there would be a great idea right now. Okay. Oh, conquest. Well, that's a little unfortunate. Whenever we get conquest, I know that my boss is going to give me a shit item. And Krampus. Oh! You're just going to give me garbage after garbage, aren't you? Yeah, Well, let's go check out the super secret real fast. Maybe I can find some health. There we go. In there. I can be a little bit better off. All right. You know what? I want to go in the bottom hole. Okay. Those are some large tears that are coming out of the uh, multi-dimensional baby. It's like they're being affected by the cold in a really, really awkward manner. I'm okay with this. I mean, coal isn't a bad item. Like, there's there's no build where coal is bad. It just gets better the further away it is from you, so. I'm not mad at it. I just was hoping something would get rid of the red heart, you know? That's all I end up wanting. And this is a dead end. Every time they do that jump and I still go into the wrong direction and get hit by it. Come on. Ah, uh, always check these rooms. What do we got here? Perthro. Oh, if only I could have both of those. If only I'd found a card generator. Or no, not, not a card generator. There's another thing that I want. Bad guess. Forget what it is. Deck of, no. Deck of cards? I think, I think that's what it's called. Yeah. Deck of cards. If we could have found that, then that would have uh, been a little bit better. Then we could have a Perth Throw and a Jera. Or we could go double Jera. I don't want to go that way. Wait, that's a ladder. We can go that way. We can go in here. This is just a free item. There we go. We'll take Gimpy with us. We'll take the Gimp. Come on with me, buddy. Why not? And those were hearts. Oh no, those were some money. This might have been giving me a soul heart? No, okay. And we can start using some of our keys here now. For Kano. We can start using a couple of our keys to hopefully find a little bit more health here. I'm not, I'm not liking this. I need to find Hif. I need to find more hef. There is no hef. Super secret room? Super secret room. Infested. No hef. Still no hef. More Bracanos. Oh boy, we are gonna die. Mama's already lost half of her health. Oh, 
Well, at least that went well. All right. Cathedral. Cathedral. We just got to make it to the chest with our four hearts. I really shouldn't be having any issues at all, but it's irrelevant. Okay. A little bit of extra health here. Maybe. Thank you. Almost ended up getting hit by my, by my scatter bomb. The scatter bomb is not being as useful as I had thought, so that's a little unfortunate. Could, tr you know what? We could try and get a health up from you real fast. Come on. Give me a little, give me a little bit of health here. Just because I've, I've made a dumb. I guess it's not that big a deal. I have to, I can't, I just completely forgot I had nine lives. Here I am worried about everything and I completely forgot I have nine lives. I'm not sure why I was so worried. I am not sure why at all why I was worried. Okay. Cool. I wonder if there's a way I could maybe get two Jera runes on the same floor. That way I could Jera and then Jera again. That would make me require 16 keys. That would be a little difficult to try and pull off, but I'd find a lot of items. And I could make a super awesome build. I think we might try it out. I think we're going to go for it. I think we're going to go for the double Jera. It's very unlikely that it's going to happen, though. That's the thing to remember. So we're going to Jera the items. We're going to jump in. We're going to hit our Jera room. We're going to try and find another Jera room. And then we're going to open up all of the items. And then we're going to hopefully find a ridiculously overpowered build. That's our goal here. We're playing this out to the maximum. Pisces. Nice. I like Pisces. I mean, I could just do it right now, but no. We got to go big. It's go big or go home. So come on, game. Give me what I want. Give me what I want. Jera? <laughs> so we're gonna Jera this again, and now we're gonna open up all the chests. Double them. Now I've got double bloody lust. Double kidney stone. Double mysterious liquid. Double proptosis. Which didn't do anything. Double odd mush. Which did do something. I could go double soy milk. I'm not going to go double soy milk. Double Seraphim, double little Lokis. Well, this looks interesting. Mm. This is definitely an interesting little run here. Keen's other eyes. Parasite for split shot. Oh boy. 
This is definitely a neat little build here. Jera? Sure. Why not? Mystery sack. Leo. We're not going to take Ludovico technique because it's not very good. Earth row. Hmm. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Eden's Blessing. Halo of Lies. Put a throw. Sure. Why not? Continuum. We'll take Dunce Cat. Iron Bar. Uh, I think that's it. Yeah, I think that's all we're going to take here. Well, that's fun and different. Okay, then. And now we have infinite keys, which is really cool. This is a lot of tears, man. This is a whole lot of tears. I think we're going to full clear this floor here. Yeah. I think we're going to go for a nice, good old full clear. Because who knows? Maybe the... Ooh, is that a Jira? No, it's a Nihuaz. But don't do anything on this floor, unfortunately. Spider baby. Juicy sack. All right. What else? Can, what other magical fun stuff can I end up finding in here? It's got to be something, right? Got to be some other fun toys. Harlequin baby. Well, that's not going to do anything for me. Found some extra keys. And that was Blue Baby. I've got to be able to find more, right? There's got to be more stuff in here. I don't know. Let's let's look around. Let's take a little looky. See if we can't uh, find something in here. I was really hoping for another Perthra room. That's what I would like to have. Blank card. Wow. Well, up. Awesome as that would be. Paralysis. As awesome as the blank card would be. It's a little wasted now. Unfortunately. And there's a steam sale. Ah, I was really hoping for an IM error room. Dang. Darn, I was really hoping for an I am air room. That's what I was trying to go for right there. But unfortunately, it didn't end up giving me what I wanted. Ah, oh well. Let's see what other, let's see what happens if I pick up all this other stuff. Might as well see if double soy milk actually does anything. Right? Here, we'll take tiny planet. Um, we'll take, oh wait, the soy milk's gone now. Rip. Well, here, let's re-roll our build. Well, that is very, very interesting to say the least. Polyphemus, Double Shot, Purity, Judas Shadow, Infestation, Bum Friend. We'll take Technology. Well, that looks incredibly depressing. Actually, no, I take that back. That looks ridiculous. <laughs> that looks terrifying. Oh, Anyway, that's the end of today's run, everybody. I hope you all enjoyed this. If you did, do me a favor. Go ahead and hit the... Uh 
hit the like button if you enjoyed it and do me a favor go ahead and subscribe if you have not already for future runs and stuff like that and hey just for today uh, I plan on playing good old, the new Doom on my live stream if that's something that interests you. I'd be live right now by the time this video's up, but uh, there's that. Anyway, thank you so very much for watching, and I'll catch you all in the next one, everybody. Later.